meat eaters beware. The price of beef is at an all-time high, and chances are you're paying for it. Well, the price of a burger or a steak, it's the highest it's ever been, and prices could continue to skyrocket. Fox 10's Mia Garcia here to tell us if we will ever see some relief. Where's the beef? It's one of the most memorable commercials of all time. You can still find old clips on YouTube. Where's the beef? And it's never been more true. Cattle ranchers, restaurant owners, and customers asking, Where's the beef? Beef supply is low, and prices of beef are record high. Well, they're higher than they've ever been. We've never seen them this high. Stockyards owner Gary Lasco has been in the restaurant business for more than 45 years. He refuses to raise prices at his steakhouse, but he's definitely taking a hit. We serve only the top 12% of the beef produced in the United States. It's all prime and choice cuts. And um, so, yeah, we just have to, you know, work our way through it. In the last 12 months, Lasco says he's seen some prices of beef go up 30%. Pork, chicken are good alternatives, but people don't come to the stockyards for pork or chicken. They come for prime cuts of beef. Beef prices are at an all-time high because cattle numbers are at an all-time low. Mother Nature, she's a fickle partner in our business. It's impacted our overall cow numbers across the nation. The polar vortex and drought killed thousands of head of cattle. Our nation's cattle numbers are at its lowest since 1973. And what you have going on is a classic uh, supply and demand. Demand's at an all-time high in the nation, and uh, we just don't have the supply to meet that demand at the moment. Until grass grows and cattle herds multiply, prices will continue to soar. Once we kind of get the rain that we need, you know, you could see the herd start to recover and as far as numbers are concerned, but that's going to take an incredible amount of time because it doesn't happen overnight. Buying bulk from specialty cattle ranchers is always an option. John Holbrook sells his northern Arizona grass-fed beef directly to customers. Well, right now we're on par with, with what's cost in the stores on some items and some items were actually cheaper. Custom Customers who used to pay more to get his specialty beef. Beef prices may be high, but people keep buying beef, even at record prices. Great news for the cattle industry during such a devastating time. I'm Mia Garcia, Fox 10 News.